Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Java UI API Exerciser. It's a project out at OpenNTF. It was contributed by um, Brian Leonard and it's pretty much supported by uh, Stanton Seavers and Ryan Baxter at this point. But what this project really does is it allows you to um, see how uh, the different uh, Java UI APIs for Lotus Notes can be used inside of an application and it actually installs a sidebar application uh, that um, you know listens for events and checks to see what's enabled and then you can inspect the different elements that uh, that you're looking at so let's go ahead and get started So we'll go ahead and start by looking at the the side shelf um, application here. We can see here Notes UI Elements, and this is kind of like an inspector type tool. So you can click on it on something that you want to look at. Like for instance, this, I can click on this view, the Notes view. Then I can add the view, and then I can inspect all of the different properties. Shows the different columns, um, you know, if, whether they're hidden or whatnot. Uh, the different properties, the view ID, uh, the notes URL to open it, etc. So you can kind of see it's it's almost like a uh, an info box um, type application for the different things that you've selected, uh, and then you can even right click and you got a bunch of options on here also. So let's go ahead and remove this. And if we click on the document, and we can now see the same level of properties for the document and you know just if it's a new doc if it's an edit mode etc current field all the different fields so let's go ahead and remove that now if we open this document it's in edit mode so you'll see you know slightly different things you'll see the properties like is it in edit mode it's true uh, the current field and you can see as I select the different fields that changes so it tells me which field I'm in and which field I'm, I'm switching to so that's pretty much it you can uh, get a lot of information for what's being selected um, but the really interesting thing about this is the fact that um, all of the source code is available on, out on OpenNTF so you can see how the different APIs are used under the different context and what I really like about this tool is the fact that it shows you how to integrate your code into the Eclipse subsystem like uh, selection and things like that uh, it's got a very good um, tree example so if you want to create trees or toolbars inside of your uh, view um, you can learn all of that just by going going and inspecting the source code um, for this neat little application so hope you liked it um, check it out on OpenNTF download the code or install it and good luck thanks